This is Walter Cronkite here at the Disney Animation Studio. Today we'll have a unique look at how their films are created. Well, sir, you sir there. Yes, sir. Could you give us a little help today? Oh, yes, sir. Well, you're, wait a minute, you're Walter Cronkite, that, and that's the way it is. Hold on, Walter, can you just a moment? <laughs> How you doing? Name's Robin, nice to be you, but you can call me Chuck. <laughs> Robin, what's your favorite Disney film? Well, to be honest, Walter, I think Fantasia has a certain Fellini-esque kind of quality, but my real favorite is Peter Pan, boy. I mean, Never Never Land. Oh, a little pixie dust and you could fly, you know? Robin, today you can visit Neverland. Oh, Walter, don't pull my leg. In order to demonstrate the animation process, we're going to turn you into an animated character. Does this mean I'm only going to have three fingers? Tinkerbell. She's so bright. Oh, it's like being in the presence of Barbara Streisand. Is this Neverland? I mean, these books are huge, and me without my cliff notes. <laughs> this is where animation begins, with a good story, adventure, romance, humor, suspense. Boy, if you get a paper cut here, Walter, you could lose a hand. <laughs> of course, since we tell our stories with pictures as well as words, we bring them together here on the storyboard. Looks like a comic strip, Walter. Right, Robin, and this is the title of your story, Back to Neverland. Well, Walter, I was thinking of maybe going with Peter Pan, First Blood. You know, coming in with twin Uzis going, Hook, we've got a problem. And have Jack Nicholson play Captain Hook going, Maybe, <laughs> maybe not, sucker, let's talk. <laughs> no, no, you're being cast as one of the little lost boys. Boy, I look so puny. You're a sympathetic little character, someone we can all feel for. You really think that people could feel for me? Well, certainly, we'll feel suspense when you're alone aboard the pirate ship. Yeah. We'll feel frightened when you're captured by Captain Hook. Yeah. And we'll all feel sorry when you're thrown to the crocodile. Yeah, me too. I'd... Whoa, whoa. Walter, Walter, what's this? What about a crocodile? What do you mean? Don't worry, there's a happy ending. This is the sound studio where your voice will be recorded for the film. What? Like these are my lines? Help, don't eat me. Ouch. I thought you said there was a happy ending, Walter. For who? The crocodile? Fine. <laughs> Help! No, don't eat me. No, please. I hope you choke on me. Help! Hey, hey, Walter, what happened? Now I'm just a voice. You see, Robin, you provide the voice, and the animator does the rest. He brings you to life on the page. It really amounts to acting on paper. When the drawings are viewed in sequence, they seem to come alive. Hey, look, I'm a cartoon. <laughs> hey, Walt, just how far can you go with this? You can do anything that he can draw. Hey, animator, what do you say we have some fun, huh? Hey, all right, let's go. Oh, I can be anything. I can be just a tiny person. Or make my eyes really big. Or maybe have legs that are real long. I can even be you, Walter Cronkite. Now hold on there. Can I do this? I'm happy. I'm grumpy. I'm dopey. <laughs> Hi, everybody. I'm a corporate symbol. Hold it. Hold it. Whoa. Are you fellas finished? <sighs> I always wanted to do that. Next, each of your drawings is photocopied onto a sheet of plastic called a cell. And you're ready for color. The colors that feel right for your character are painted on the back of the cell. Careful. Stay in the lines, babe. Don't want to lose anything. And there you are. All right. Now can we go to Neverland? Can we, Uncle Walter? Huh? Huh? Maybe, please? Huh? We're almost there. The layout artists are drawing the sets for you now. These skilled artists create the fantasy world in which you will act. Ooh, nice boat, dude. The background artists help establish the mood of the scene by painting it with appropriate colors. Makes me feel like singing. A pirate's life is a wonderful life, a rover over the sea. Of course, this is a much more appropriate mood for your scene. It gives the proper air of foreboding. For what? Hey, 
This is the part where Captain Hook shows up, right? <laughs> and there's a crocodile, right? Whoa. <laughs> what am I doing here? See you later, Walter. Oh, come now, Robin. <laughs> You're headed the wrong way. Walter, Walter, put me down. Oh, oh, oh. oh no, put me down, Walter. This is the oh. camera department where all of these elements oh. of story, character, acting, and mood are photographed for the final film. Walter, here's a little crazy idea of mine. What do you think? Let's lose the part with the crocodile! Walter, please! It all begins to feel pretty convincing by the time it reaches this stage, doesn't it? Walter? What's that, Walter? Music and sound effects complete the feeling of reality. Walter, all, all that, that mood, mood stuff really works, works Walter. Walter. This is is really creepy. Well, well, one of Peter Pan's little lost boys. No, wait, Hook. I can explain. I didn't want to bother you, see? There was Walter Cronkite and storyboards and animators. <laughs> please, please. I throw myself at your good leg and, and beg for mercy. Where is Peter Pan hiding? I'm drawing a big blank on that, too, man. Listen, you're a drawing, I'm a drawing. Let's lighten up here, man. Ah! No, no, you don't want to eat me. Whoa! Hey, you know, you are very, very rough on your skin here. I think you need something as a conditioner. Whoa! Tinker, Tinker, Tinkerbell, Tinkerbell. Yeah, Pixie does. Douse me, babe. That's it. <laughs> Blast that Tinkerbell. Hey, Tink. Come here. What do you say? Come on, let's come on, come on. Let's come on. <laughs> shh, shh. Hey, time to play that exciting new game show. You bet your hook. That's right. Our contestant is a pirate. He's also a villain. Let's welcome him, please. Captain Hook. Hi, nice to have you on the show. Nice hat. <laughs> hey, you know, you're not wearing one. I'm kidding. Here we go. Here's our guest. It's time to play the big $20,000 question. What has four legs of voracious appetite and is right behind you? Uh, time's up. It's a crocodile. Come on down. <laughs> hey, Tink, slip me some wings. Pow! I think you've got the general idea. It's time to come back now. Oh, but I just got here. Now, Robin, we don't want to miss the rest of the tour. Oh, yeah. That's right, but I didn't get to meet Peter or Wendy or anybody, Walter. I beat Captain Hook, and I was flying, Walter. Oh, boy, Walter. Come on, Robin. What are you hanging around for? Let's go have some fun. Look, Walter, you finish up with the tour. I'll catch up with the next group, OK? Now, Robin. Hey, wait for me, Peter! And that's the way it is. Oh, Robin! Oh, Robin! Oh, Robin! Keep the jacuzzi hot. I'll be back. Come on, everybody. Here we go.